Good afternoon, everybody. Or good e Actually, it's good e Good evening. Good evening, everybody. Uh, we are rocking and a rolling. We are rocking and a rolling in the fields. Me and my dad. I'm in the 6420. I got the older disc bind behind me. He's got the 6210 with the newer disc bind. And we're we're, uh, we're mowing hay. We are mowing hay. And this field is so freaking rough. I blame it on moles. We had this field worked up and smoothed out and real nice. Back for uh, 2011. 2011. There was wheat in here. And, uh, then the hay, we, were, we seeded wheat down with uh, hay as the, I guess the wheat was a parent crop and then uh, the orchard grass and everything was meant to come up afterwards, which it did. So we combined the wheat off of this and uh, yeah, we had it, so we had it disc down, or actually we mold board plowed this Dissed it down, coal mulched it the whole nine yards before we planted it. And it was smooth that it was smoother than a baby's butt. And the grass came the grass came up and there for there for a couple three years everything was fine. And then I think it was 2015 I noticed. 2015 I noticed how rough this field was starting to get. And you can't really blame it on erosion. Because, I mean, other than a little, little gradient right here, and maybe a little bit up there, this field is flat. And, um, I mean, I would expect, like, down here in this little valley, and then right in here, there might be something from water runoff, but, I mean, other than that, that shouldn't, it shouldn't have eroded this bad in this short amount of time. So, I blame it on one suspect, moles. Yes, if you got moles in your yard, you know how freaking rough it is to mow your yard when you got moles digging up underneath of it. That's, that's what I blame on what's happening here. And my uncle also sides with me a little bit on that too. He believes, honestly, that's what it is too. So, I don't know if there's anything you can do to it, do to this field. Because, um, I mean, other than, other than this rough part, the field is perfect. The, the pH level is like 6.4. Uh, all the nutrients are good. So, so, I don't know. I mean, heck, don't know what it could be. But we think it's moles that's infested this dang thing, this dang field. But uh, but anyway, so after the mole story, uh, one uncle is planting soybeans with the 4455 on the uh, on that uh, pasture ground that we took the hay off of. He is planting up there, and then my other uncle is top dressing some more corn. Uh, if you remember the video, yeah, the video of us filling the planter, he is top dressing that farm right there. So, and after he does that, I think he's only got one field. After he gets that done tonight, I think one more field and all the corn is top dressed, I think. Ed, Noble, Bills, Dr. Gorge. Yeah, heck, that's all the corn. So anyway, but yeah, uh, we're just, so we're all doing something here. And uh, I took off work tomorrow. Uh, it is summer break, by the way, and I am working part slash full-time in southern states this summer 
So I asked to be off tomorrow. That way in the morning I could go get the neighbor's hay cut down. That way we can get him done. And, uh, and then I'll work a full day Thursday. And then I took half a day Friday. That way in the afternoon I could help my uncle get this raked and rolled. Get everything raked and rolled. Actually, this will... Dang, this, this will this will mow... Um, Today's Tuesday. This will this will bail Thursday evening, hopefully. Hopefully. So, and then what I mow in the morning or tomorrow should be uh, Friday, Friday afternoon. So, anyway, we're rocking. Uh, we've got the big field here, and then there's a little patch over there, and then another slightly bigger patch over there. All in all, it's about 30, 30, between 30 and 35 acres, probably. And, then, uh, and that's that. So, first first crop hay is winding down, slowly but surely. But but we're we're sitting pretty good right now. So anyway, I'm gonna get off here. I'm gonna keep rocking and rolling. See what, and then get lined out for tomorrow. What all I need to mow back there tomorrow. I'm, I would think everything because they're not hollering any rain till next Monday night. And today is Tuesday. Today is Tuesday, June 6th. 6th of June. And they're hollering rain the next Monday. So, oh well, we're sitting good. Anyway, thanks for watching. Please comment, rate, and subscribe. Keep on keep the comments rolling the thumbs ups going and everything in between i enjoy it i know i'll kind of slow down here with the videos but i'm still i'm still here so anyway thanks for watching